Hello welcome to Objective Question Answer MCQ's YouTube channel. With a positive vibes let's start this video. Question number 1. If medium, A, is optically denser than medium, B, then the speed of light is. Option A the same in both mediums. Option B higher in medium A than in medium B. Option C higher in medium B than in medium A. Option D higher in medium A or B depending on which medium is thicker. The right answer is option D. Higher in medium A or B depending on which medium is thicker. If medium A is optically denser than medium B, then the speed of light is higher in medium A or B depending on which medium is thicker. Question number 2. When light travels from an optically denser medium to a rarer medium. Option A it bends away from the normal. Option B it bends towards the normal. Option C it is undeviated. Option D it is laterally displaced. The right answer is option D. It is laterally displaced. When light travels from an optically denser medium to a rarer medium, it is laterally displaced. Question number 3. The splitting of white light into its constituent colors is called Option A refraction Option B dispersion Option C deviation Option D displacement The right answer is option B Dispersion the splitting of white light into its constituent colors is called dispersion. Question number 4. At what position of the object does a convex lens act as a magnifying glass? Option A between F and 2F. Option B between F and 0. Option C beyond F. Option D beyond 2F. The right answer is option B. Between F and 0. Between F and 0, a convex lens act as a magnifying glass. Question number 5. Which of the following is true for a person suffering from myopia? Option A can see far off objects clearly but near objects appear blurred. Option B can be corrected using a convex lens. Option C far point is at finite distance, and not at infinity. Option D near point is beyond 25 centimeters. The right answer is option C. Far point is at finite distance, and not at infinity. Among the following, far point is at finite distance, and not at infinity is true for a person suffering from myopia. Question number 6. If a person is suffering from hypermetropia, which object is he or she most likely to see blurred? Option A object 25 centimeters away. Option B object 10 m away. Option C object 100 m away. Option D object at infinity. The right answer is option A. Object 25 centimeters away. If a person is suffering from hypermetropia, object 25 centimeters away is he or she most likely to see blurred. 
Question number 7. Which one of these controls the amount of light entering the eye? Option A pupil. Option B iris. Option C cornea. Option D ciliary muscles. The right answer is option B. Iris. Among these, iris controls the amount of light entering the eye. Question number 8. Myopia is corrected by using spectacles with Option A convex lenses Option B concave lenses Option C glass slabs Option D prisms The right answer is option B Concave lenses Myopia is corrected by using spectacles with concave lenses. Question number 9. When white light passes through a prism, it is. Option A deviated and dispersed. Option B deviated but not dispersed. Option C laterally displaced and not dispersed. Option D reflected. The right answer is option A. Deviated and dispersed. When white light passes through a prism, it is deviated and dispersed. Question number 10. How many dots does the Braille system use? Option A5. Option B6. Option C10. Option D11. The right answer is option B. 6. The Braille system use 6 dots. Question number 11. Myopia can be corrected using. Option A. Concave lens. Option B convex lens. Option C cylindrical lens. Option D plano convex lens. The right answer is option A. Concave lens. Myopia can be corrected using concave lens. Question number 12. A triangular piece of glass that breaks up white light into spectrum is Option A concave lens Option B prism Option C mirror Option D convex lens The right answer is option B Prism a triangular piece of glass that breaks up white light into spectrum is prism. Question number 13. The eye perceives an object as moving when images are flashed on the eye at a rate. Option A. Faster than 10 per second. Option B. Slower than 10 per second. Option C faster than 16 per second. Option D slower than 16 per second. The right answer is option C. Faster than 16 per second. The eye perceives an object as moving when images are flashed on the eye at a rate faster than 16 per second. Question number 14. A person sees blurred images of all objects around him or her. That person is suffering from. Option A myopia. Option B hypermetropia. Option C night blindness. Option D cataract. The right answer is option D. Cataract. 
a person sees blurred images of all objects around him or her. That person is suffering from cataract. Question number 15. Light in optical fiber is. Option A refracted. Option B reflected. Option C straightened. Option D reflected totally internally. The right answer is option D. Reflected totally internally. Light in optical fiber is reflected totally internally. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel Objective Question Answer MCQs. And always remember, never stops learning, because life never stops teaching.